I think um, the, the best way, it, well, there's two things that I do. One is I, I'm, I feel very comfortable and confident talking and answering questions about things I know about. Mm -hmm. And so I think just thinking to yourself, and I did this as a teacher too, I think to myself, I know this stuff. <laughs> I, know, I know it. I can talk about it. I'm not afraid if people ask questions. Mm -hmm. And the other is if people also completely understand if you don't know the answer to something. So it's, I have, I am found it very easy to just say, I don't, I don't know. Um, that's a really good question. I don't know. Mm -hmm. In my work, it's usually that's followed by, you know, I want to find out more about that. So mm -hmm. can you come talk to me about it? Or, you know, I know where I can look to find mm -hmm. that information and I'll look that up. But I think that's the, I don't, you don't want to just bluff or make things up. <laughs> so, I think it's, so I think, but if you know the, if you know what the subject is that you're talking about, a question and answer period can be fine. It can be mm -hmm. fun. Yeah. I don't, um, it's also, I can be, I think I can be, though people might disagree with this, but I think that um, humor part of it is really good in a question and answer too. Mm -hmm. and I, I'm usually pretty good about um, thinking, uh, answering questions, even thinking about things that are kind of funny and answering them in a, being a little bit witty on the, on the spot. So. What about hostile questions? You know, I don't, um, I ran for office, which is probably, in my job, I hardly ever get hostile questions. Mm -hmm. Actually, that's, you know, maybe that's, maybe that's part of the trick is I don't tend to see questions as hostile, maybe even when they are. Mm -hmm. I try and give people the benefit of the doubt that they're not really trying to mm -hmm. trick me or they're not really trying to, to be hostile. They're just, they just don't know how to ask the question in a different way or, mm -hmm. or they are angry or frustrated about something. Mm -hmm. So I think probably, because I was just thinking, I can't remember a hostile question, but I'm sure that's not true. I'm sure that's not true. Um, so I think it's probably a matter of taking it on face value. Okay, you're asking me this question because you really sincerely want to know, mm -hmm. even if they don't, um, but you sincerely want to know this, so I'm going to answer it as sincerely and honestly mm -hmm. as I can. Mm -hmm. So if you ask me, you know, why did the Labor Council screw up on this thing, mm -hmm. then I'm going to try and answer, you know, well, I don't think we screwed up, but here's why we did what we did. So mm -hmm. I think that's the best way to address it. I don't, I like to think that if somebody asked a really inappropriate question mm -hmm. that I could say, that's a really inappropriate question. I'm just not going to answer it. Um, mm -hmm. I'm, I don't know if that's happened to me. Um, but I think it's, I think the key is to not be defensive, but mm -hmm. Just assume the person's asking a question because they generally want to genuinely mm -hmm. want to know mm -hmm. and answer it in that spirit. Mm -hmm. um, Professionally, right, right, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Professionally and and you know with kindness and and compassion and and the facts. <laughs> I guess I'm mm -hmm. a big. I, I mm -hmm. think you just if you're direct and and honest. Mm -hmm. So, but I'm not. Yeah, I I think it's. I think maybe that's the key is I don't tend to think of, even if they are, I don't think I recognize them as hostile questions. And maybe later I think, oh, I, that was a crappy thing to do. Why'd they say that? <laughs> but I think at the time, you know, and I, I think that's probably, you're, you're buoyed when you're public speaking. I mean, you are. You've got your own endorphins flow in there. So you are in a, you are buoyed. And, you know, the anxiety, I'm sure, um, can help with that, can help you feel more. So I think that's the key is probably not mm -hmm. to see it as hostile, but just to see it as not the way you'd word it, but mm -hmm. a genuine question that needs to be answered in a genuine way.